go. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Moving under it the back back. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Now batting. Right here. Right here. there. Nick Markakis. Okay. One away for the Braves here in inning number eight. And standing in the powerful right fielder, Nick Markakis. We got it. He did have an error catcher or through, so it's not a perfect game, but, but we're like two or three a little bouncer. away. Foul ball, however, strike we're losing one. 20 strikeouts in one game by a pitcher. So we're kind of excited about that. Lifted in the air to center. And this is taken in easily, and just like that, two are gone to start the eighth inning. Up next for Atlanta, Castro. third baseman, Daniel out his last time Castro. Ty uh, but Tyler Flowers hit a two-run home run. We got a manufactured run Down in the first the inning. Base line. Oh, and it eats That's an error. That'd be a base hit. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base Good safely. Thing. The shortstop beat that. Now so batting. That's love. Second uh, base. Basically, that should be in there. Jordan Pachanko steps in now. Jordan Pachanko, from the Reds, the Braves signed him as a uh, free agent. Played lots of positions. I don't think he hits a lot, but we'll take him. Hit high in the air down the right field line. Granderson under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Braves strand one. They lead it three to nothing. We've had two errors, but we're we're hitting. They're you know we're just not blowing them out. As you see there, they're Neil Walker. It's leading up for the match. They're going here. Second baseman. Okay, so Neil Walker. Seventy nine pitches. Fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's zero and one. Yeah, he probably won't have too big a dip in velocity the rest of the way. But the later this game goes, the more important it will be to watch where his location is. That's probably the bigger concern. And it's quickly going to the ball. Oh, and two. Here it comes on nothing and two. And it's away from chase. Him. Okay. He's in a bit too close for comfort. And even on 0-2, you don't want guys to get into a comfort level. Here we go. Get somebody up, or do we let him try to do it? He's starting to get a little wild. Think we're going to get somebody up with a bullpen. We're going to get up to it. So I heard it's a big thing. The Braves are going to get a lefty up and throwing in their bullpen. One and two. One and two. Three feet behind the batter. 
wind up fielding the baseball and tagging the runner all in one motion. I think he just broke the laws of physics out there. Kelly, uh, John. Kelly Johnson comes forward. Oh, this is Johnson. He's got to get on base any way he can with that possible tying run standing behind him in the on-deck circle. He wanted to go after that one, but that's a good eye to just watch it all the way in. No runs, just one hit. And no errors on the net line score so far. One ball, two Helping strikes. him out here as he swings and misses to fall behind a ball and two strikes. Seems like we've seen a lot of guys late on the fastball tonight. And he's not throwing all that hard either. When he throws it off the other... And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Met strand one. Still down. They get one hit, but they do get a strikeout. Now, beautiful look there feet. outside the home of the Mets here in Flushing as we welcome you back for the ninth. And flush, that's where it goes. Mets skipper Terry Collins out to home plate. Another. And it looks like we'll see a double switch here. Another one. You see Johnson? I don't know if it's Johnson there. Your attention, please. He's changing for the man. Now pitching in the right right spot. Number 47, Hansel Robles. Now playing third base and batting in the ninth spot. Number five, David Wright. He's been in total control of this game, man. I see no reason to be going with anybody else out there on the mound right now. Hit hard on the ground at second. On the first He's three, out. and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Now batting, number 17. Number Not 17 it. stands in. Not a commission guy. Let's see. Lifted the other way out to left center. After it is chest footed. Two down. The batter number one, the plate, short Eric Ibar, already Eric two for two, Ibar. we'll look to add on right here. Let's see what the we pit. can do, and... Sent on the ground, out to second. On the third, and can you believe it, a three. Striding in to start the ninth, David, David Wright, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up.
Curtis Granderson will stand in, and he, like so many others, hitless in the ballgame so far. So that just about does it. For E.K., Psycho, and the crew, I'm Matt Vasturgeon. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, get those smart... The final line score for our ballgame tonight. I think the highlights are great. The Braves without the free run. 11 hits, 2 errors. They left 8 men on base. For the Mets, no run. Only 2 hits, no errors. They left 3 men on base. The winning pitcher is Julio Tejeran. His record is now four and seven. Give the save to Julio Tejeran. The loss goes to Jacob DeGrom, his seventh loss of the season. Is a save. Time of the ball game, two hours and 36 minutes. Tonight's paid attendance at City Field, 45,000. The Mets thank you for your continued support and remind you to please drive home safely.
Guys, we broke the director and it looks like we're gonna go check and see if it's in the record book now. 109 pitches. camera yeah ha ha have fun you too Season. So now I have single game. Out of all the games I have left, I chose Tyler. Okay. I only okay. have five that I actually want to play out of all of them. Okay, have fun. I'm not really a big gamer. But did you actually see a game like that hunting game? Yeah, up there 24-7. If it's there, then it's out of the stores right now, isn't it? I, ha I, th I would assume so. Hmm. See the... Maybe it's the second one to this one, right? It could be, yeah. Next month I'll be getting money. Hopefully I can save, um, how much do you think it cost? I think it's like three for ten bucks. I just have to save ten bucks, right? Yeah, you go get it if you want to. I'm not stopping you. I will. I'm sorry I couldn't keep the promise, but I had to tell them. Okay. I tell them everything. Okay. I can't keep secrets from Donna. I've tried before and I always fail. Okay. I didn't know that it would go bad for me though. Well, I help you out. Be a nice guy. I'll try next year then. Alright. Maybe she'll allow me you to make plans with me next year, right? Alright, we'll see what happens. You never know. Guess why? You know how I know that? Donna always changes her mind in the future. Well, I wouldn't assume that. She always does with me. She does everything. But she doesn't know that she usually allows me to go. I thought one time she wanted me to go even though I was grounded.